Today, we're learning how to make this clean paper crunch transition in Canva in just a few simple steps. Start by opening Canva and creating a new design. I'm working in a mobile crop for this tutorial, but you can follow along in any format that suits your project. On your first page, place your base footage to get the scene set up. Then add a second page. Open the videos library and search for paper background. Choose one of the light colored options and set it as the background of page two. You can add any extra design or elements you want on this page. We use a paper background here because it makes the crunch transition feel natural. If the paper crunch transitions straight into a regular scene, like your first page, it won't look convincing. It should always transition onto something that resembles paper or sits in that same visual category. Next, go back to the videos library and search for paper. Select the green screen paper crunch clip. Increase the speed slightly, then trim it down so it only shows one full crunch cycle. Now remove the green screen using the background remover. You'll notice a bit of green hue left behind. That's completely normal with this kind of footage, and we can fix it easily. With the clip selected, open Edit, go to Adjust, then boost the whites and drop both vibrance and saturation all the way down. Keep adjusting until the tone of the paper matches the background on the next page. Resize the clip so that the final frame covers the entire canvas. Then set the timing so the crunch animation plays only at the very end of your scene. Like this. And that's it. A clean, crisp paper crunch transition in Canva. By the way, if you're interested in creating one of these noir executive figure animations from a single stock image in Canva, make sure to subscribe. That tutorial is coming next. And if you'd like to see this paper crunch transition integrated into a fully sound designed Vox style edit, click here. You're going to love it. Until next time.